All right, here we are. We are here in Queenstown, New Zealand. I made it to my Airbnb. It's been a long travel day, but these are the views from our Airbnb. Got the mountains in the back, the lake right in front of us. Uh, I was here in 2019 when I was playing PJ for China, but I also grew up out here as well. I, uh, I used to live in a place called Fangare up there in the New North Island and also in Auckland from like the ages of two to six. So I had the accent and everything. Unfortunately, I lost it. I wish I didn't, but yeah, I'm ex excited to be out here. Uh, my eyes also a little bit red from the from the travel day. I think something got in there, so I might, might have to go with glasses, but um, I figured I'd do a little little challenge for myself, and I'm not sure how easy or hard this is going to be, but I'm going to make it so that for all of my rounds here in New Zealand, not just Queenstown, I want to try to get my total score under even par. I know there's going to be a few courses where I haven't seen any of the holes, so that's going to make it a little bit tougher, and also there's a course in Taupo that's actually a really hard course that I played last time I was here. Definitely going to have to have a little bit of a cushion room going into Taupo, which is the second leg of this trip. But honestly, I feel a bit of pressure being out here in New Zealand making videos because I just want to make great videos for you guys out here in my country that I grew up in. Uh, but honestly, in a, in a place like this in Queenstown, it's, the views are kind of doing a lot of the work, the heavy lifting for me. So don't think it'll be too hard to show you guys how cool New Zealand is. So let's get right into the video. All right, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to another video. A different kind of video for you guys. A little bit different part of the world as well, as you can see with the mountains back there. And my boy Ty, he's joining me for this video. I, I met up with him when I was in New Zealand in 2019, so known him for a little while. So me and Ty are gonna be out here at Millbrook and we're gonna try doing a little, little break 65 action here. Ty has been- uh, 72, so seven under. Yeah. Oh. All right, we got a, I'm assuming there's a par four, no? Well, you haven't played uh, this course either, have you? I think there's a par five. Mm -hmm. Par five? Yep. It does look down. pretty long. It is pretty straight though. Mm -hmm. There is Hobie left, so don't go left. Alright, no toe bangers. Start the day. Oh, it's kind of low there. Yeah. Is that right? I don't like it, but it'll work. Roll ball. Good. Okay, straight down, par five, first hole. Just uh, swipe it, I guess. Swipe it. Oh my, like he never left. What is that? Oh, we go. Yeah, I think he walks right through the yeah. shot tracer. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'll give you a hint. Right after you hit it, just walk backwards. Yeah, walk left. It's, it's kind of stupid. It feels dumb, but that's just how I do it. Also, we got my boy Daniel out here helping me film. Uh, he actually has his own YouTube channel he's been starting up here recently. What's it called? Bunker Boys. Bunker Boys. Check us out. Yeah, y'all go check him out. He's actually, he's been he's been doing the video stuff for a while, so definitely very lucky that I have him helping me out because it would be a lot of work just to pass the camera back and forth. But should be a lot of fun out here. A beautiful place, Queenstown, New Zealand. Excited to show you guys this place. All right, so we're out here with my boy Ty. You AKA, guys AKA Taco Golf. Taco. Follow me on Instagram. Oh, wow, the early <laughs> shout out in the video. <laughs> no, but he does have some great stuff in there. If you guys want some like instructional golf stuff, I definitely recommend this guy's stuff. I mean, he's, he's played on New Zealand PGA for years and Korea PGA. Yeah, Korean PGA, Aussie, bit of Asia. Yeah, I mean, you've actually done this whole like pro golf thing, so. Mm. But yeah. myself up I know. for this match. I know. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, you haven't been play playing a whole lot lately. You've been kind of doing more of the coaching. No, I'm doing some coaching. Posting some content on Instagram for yeah. people who you want to, you know, get better at golf. Yeah, yeah. If I just play good golf, there's no real, yeah, it's real value out into the world. It's real know? selfish. So, of yeah, you. it's very selfish. So I, I want you, to, you guys, to get better. So yeah, we're gonna keep a tally on who out drives who. Oh, the you're gonna lose. Yeah. Are you sure you want to do that? He's, he's like 200 pounds. Oh, here we go. 226. All right, we got 120. 120. We got 226. A little bit of sprinkle coming down right now. Just barely crept into the first cut. 226, probably gonna go with the five right here. Look at that draw, Ty. Oh, that looks good. Look at that draw, Ty. I think it's gonna be pretty good. I, I don't know, though. Yeah, it's like Tom Green front side. Oh, front? So it's gonna get back there. Okay, I've got 199 meters. Meters? Which is about 218 yards. Got four iron. 
I was going to hit a big towering cut up there. Close to cut. Or double cross action. Oh. But like, in the hole. <laughs> it's like right at the flag. It's a little long though, I think. I had my forearm too good. I'm in this back bunker. Short sided, downhill lie. So not much of a future. Let's, let's see what we can do here. There you go. Well, that made a weird sound when it made it. <laughs> All right, well, I mean, just from this angle, I feel like Ty had a pretty hard shot. That was, I don't know where this is coming from. He just said he hasn't played in like two months. All right, we got a uh, putt that's up and over a ridge. Just gotta get the speed right. First hole. Oh, it's gotta go a lot. Hey, I got it halfway there. I don't want to start off with it. He's going triple the three point. <laughs> There, you there it go. is. Easy two putt. Nice birdie. Look like a two putt the whole way. <laughs> nice. This is so cool. <laughs> Y'all see that view right there, Daniel? Show them that. Show them that mountain right there. Clouds. <laughs> Queenstown is a special place. Beautiful. Yeah, it's beautiful. All right, we got a part three here. Like I said, the views here is sick. I keep looking at the mountain, not the flag. 208 flag, uphill. Probably going with 218. Not a whole lot of wind. I think it's gonna be a four iron. Mmm. That? Oh, I'll get in. Pretty good. That all? Oh, sh What was that? The four. four? Come back down. Keep going. What about three? All right, it came down. All right, Ty's going with the three here. Cutting again. Oh my goodness. Whoa. It came down. Hey, that hill must be <laughs> so <very> steep. <laughs> it must be such a steep <laughs> slope. Blew yours, it into that. I was gonna say yours landed into it. Alright. Strike my three iron to this hill and hold back. But uh, I've got about 20 meter chip down the hill. Looks pretty quick down there. About 58. Okay. Trickle. Trickle. Oh, tough though. Tough little butt. Yeah. All right. Like Ty said, I mean, his chip was really fast. I'm coming from the same angle as well. Mine's, it, you kind of can't really see it on this side, like where the camera's seeing it, but like, it's really slanted down that way. So definitely got to tickle it down in there. Trickle. 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 Yeah, that's pretty good. Honestly, I'm pretty happy with that. Yeah, this, this putt is, Fast here. Double good. Easy nice. Bus. All right, guys. So I got four and a half feet, but it's breaking about a foot. A little trickly Augusta putt. Oh, I thought you did it. I thought you did it. That's good. That's all good. I'm at one under now. Ty is. Are you back to even? Yep. Decent start. These first two holes here. Let's go. Part four looks like, down the hill, doesn't look too long. OB up the left, houses, so don't go left. Good thoughts. Cutter up the left hand side. Push it. Dude, I feel like you were just talking as you are doing your takeaway. <laughs> bunker there, maybe bunker. Is that reachable? Uh, the bunkers, I mean? In between, bunkers and them. Oh, okay. All right, also going with driver here. Uh, I guess those bunkers are in play, so I get a little, little advantage just looking off of Ty's ball there. Catch it! Oh, wow! Rolled out! Dang, getting all the lucky breaks here early. Love that. Okay, found the rough here, a little push cut. It's not in the end of the world. 
96 meters, can't see the pin, but tuck the little pin up the front, try land it about 90, let it run. Alright, we, we got really lucky here. Honestly, the reason why I was telling it to go in the bunker is because out of bounds is right here. So if it didn't catch the bunker, be routine. But we got 102. Pin looks like it's in the front. So I'm probably going to go with a soft uh, 51 degree. Land it short, let it ho hopefully it bounces up. Oh, settle. Settle. Oh, that's definitely not, not landing short. Had the plan, didn't execute. I want the camera to do it justice, but it just doesn't quite get it on video, like what we're looking at here. The sun over there, the foliage, nothing like this place. We are on the green. Bad news is, it's a quick one, and it's moving to the left. If there's a spot to miss this shot on the green, it's definitely not where I am. Gotta go a little bit more. A little bit more. That was close. That was really close. I know it's six feet, but if I just hit that like a foot harder, I think it would have trickled out. Should be moving a decent amount right to left. Not like breaking super hard, but it's definitely outside the hole. Nope, 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 nope. Dang it. That was good. I've got about six and a half feet, but just like the last part, it's moving, but the opposite way, so like a foot outside the right. Oh, shout that. Oh, I thought it was going to snap for you. Okay, still not bad, not bad par from this whole position. He, he missed it in the right spot. Where we were, where I was, not, not a very good chance there. <laughs> okay, par four, longish one. 402 meters downwind though. There is a bit of rock falling off the left here, so don't hit that. Like yes, that. sir. Ty, I don't believe you that you haven't been playing for two months. I mean, that, that's really good. All right, I now see what Ty's talking about if I'm trying to hit a fade. So, no longer gonna hit a fade. See what I see. Yeah, I'm, I'm, that rock is in my, in my line. I mean, not actually, but you know, I'm gonna go with a draw driver. Oh, draw oh, driver! A little much, a little much. Get up! Roll through like what? Oh, that's not even in the bunker. I thought it was gonna land in the bunker. It's like 285 to the lip, and I was like short of it. Whatever. We'll go figure it out from there. So I bounced around these little yeah, must the grass. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh my! How lucky is that? Uh, if you don't shoot 65 here, right? <laughs> All right, I got 140 yards. Uh, pins in the front. I think we're downwind. Pretty good, pretty good amount downwind. I've never seen a cart girl park in front of the green. All right, I'm going. I'm probably gonna go with like a 125 pitching wedge shot. I'm trying to I'm trying to land this ball short of the green, and let it bounce up. See if I can execute this time. Kind of worked out. Yeah, I landed a little shorter than I thought, but shorter than I was trying to, but it worked out. I have 73 meters. Pen is tucked, so I need to land this a little short. It was land, landed like 68. That's it. Oh my god. It might be a bit long. This ball actually ended up pin high-ish, like 20 feet maybe. It's moving right to left. Would like to get the stroke, get the bogey back with this birdie here, hopefully. Mm, not enough break yeah. on it. That's good. That's all right. Good path. Uh, the T shot. Also a good T shot. Yeah. All right, guys, I just keep finding myself hard putts. About 16 feet down the hill, right to left. Just trickle on down. Talk to me. Oh, oh. my God, did that go in? Because that's five feet fast. Oh. <laughs> should be a formality. Keyword should. 
Yep, there you go. All right, we got we got a par five here. Uh, dog to the right, into the wind too. I don't think those bunkers are carryable. So definitely gotta, gotta hit a good drive here. Sure. I think you just rolled in. Rolled in, okay. Um, into the wind now, par five, like Luke said. Just try and really kind of thread the needle here. There's bunkers left and right. Who's that? I didn't see it. It's a year. Had a good drive, but unfortunately landed in the bunker. I'm gonna have to lay up. There is a bit of a lip, but it shouldn't be a problem. We've got four iron. Might be thin. Very thin. Yeah, it works out. It'll work. It works out. Thin to win. All right. Well, honestly, I, I actually thought this bunker was out of play because that that bunker lip was like 300 to carry, and it's into the wind. But hey, we're in this bunker. Got some lip trouble here. Probably all I can do is hit an eight iron out. Figure it out from there. It's definitely gonna go nowhere if you hit the lip. Yeah, it's not gonna go. Just don't go in the bunker. Oh. Is it in the bunker? No way. <laughs> Just crept in. There's rough there. How did it roll through? Oh man. All right. Well, unfortunately, found the bunker again. Into the wind still. Uh, this is gonna have to be a really good shot. Lie's not great either. Honestly, if it rolls up somewhere around the green, honestly, I'll, I I like it. Work out for me. Stay. Oh, settle. I don't know why, but I feel like that's pretty good. Saw a lot of bounces right there. So I feel like it can't be like that far over. We'll see. Okay, got away with the uh, layup. So I've got 103 meters, so about 115 yards. Up the hill, into the wind, I've got pitching wedge. Drive one in there low. Low, low, draw, three quarter one. Uh, looks decent. Uh, my ball ended up here a little further, close to the hole than I was imagining. Just got a pretty simple chip shot here, a little into the wind. Enough green to work with. Let's try to hit this thing close. Settle, 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 settle. Settle, 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 settle. Oh, I knew it was a little firm right off the face. Gotta go try to make that. Okay, came up a little short, downhill, about. 30 feet. I'm not really trying to make this, I'm just trying to get it down there. Secure a nice, easy par. Stretch, stretch. Talk to Had me. Line. Oh. Had the line. Good par. It's actually a little uphill at the end. Yeah. Yeah. That's good. <laughs> Alright, well, we gotta get this putt to drop. It's been a rough hole so far, but if I can get out of this hole with a par, it's fine. Oh! I knew I shoved it right off the face a little bit. Ah! Get out of the hole. <laughs> can't, even get the, can't get the ball in the hole, and once it's in, I can't get it out. I've got eight and nine, it's 177 meters, but it's straight downwind. Uh, it's like 10 meters downwind, I feel like. It's also downhill. Yeah, so, and the greens are firm. I think I'm gonna go nine. It probably is gonna be short, but, you know, we live and learn. The club. We live and learn. All right, nine, I'm gonna try hoist it up. Hoist. 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 Uh, stay right, stay right. Go. Oh, that's actually gonna, I thought it was gonna bounce forward. The wind kind of stopped, eh? Yeah. All right, I'm going with the nine iron. I think nine iron's a club for me. Get it up in the air, just like Ty said. Come on, you can get this back to even. Nice and toey. That's gotta go, probably. Catch, let's go. Oh, big bounce. Yeah. 
All right, not the greatest, but hey, it kind of worked out. We gotta get a putt to drop, man. What are you, one over? Yeah, one over right now. Mm. You're right even. Yeah, after that little little miss. Yeah, it's a little bit of a slow start for both of us. It's quite windy. It, it is, is It is pretty windy. And I, I didn't think the greens would be this. This firm. Yeah, this firm and also like undulating. Yeah, you know? yeah. I had a good nine iron, but it just landed soft on me. I've got about 35 feet up the hill now, so just trying to lag it up there. Yep. Well done. Well done. All right. Got my putt. Slightly closer than ties. Caught it kind of weird, and I don't know. I just bounced up a little bit more because of that. But I'm trying to make a putt here. Slightly low, like I thought. Next. To the next. To the next. It's all good. Two pars in this hole. Bit of a tricky tee shot over there with all the wind and a downhill, but. See what the next hole is. It's like 327 to yards to carry the bunker on the left, like green side. So it's, I think on a normal day, it's probably drivable, but we're uh, into the wind here. So probably not quite, but we got a little flip wedge in, into this green, probably, if we can hit a good one. Yeah, I'm gonna tee this one down because it's into the wind. I'm gonna show you guys a stinger. Oh, stinger. Yeah, a little stinger. Not a healy. Not a draw. It's not really thing. Oh. Wait, that landed way further than I was thinking. Ah. Uh, you caught that healy? Uh, no. yeah, maybe a smidge, but the face was just open. Yeah. I think I'm gonna go with the same strategy as Ty. There's like a little tree off the left side of the tee box here, so. Low draw, same as Ty. Oh. Stay, 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 stay. A little overcooked there, isn't it? Oh, I think that's bunker. Maybe over it. Knowing my luck today, I think I'm over that bunker, but I feel like that luck might have ran out at yeah. this point. <laughs> I've rolled out of I've rolled out of two bunkers so far. We'll see. Like I said, I think ran out of luck there. I'm in the bunker in here in the fairway. Jeez, the fairway bunker. Uh, 90 yards into the wind. I'm probably gonna go with the 51 degree. I'm just kind of happy that I'm not in like the 50 yard range because that is the hardest shot in golf. This one at least is slightly more normal. Oh, a slightly chunked, I think. No, nope, that's fine. Stay, 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 stay. Woo! Oh. Oh. I knew I was gonna rip hard. Almost went bunker to bunker again. Bunker boys. 64 meters, 70 yards for the Americans. Got to carry about 55. Why? Not the best, but that's okay. Let's see what we do. Hmm. That's pretty good. I mean, it's about as good as you can do there. Yep. Well, I'm glad I stayed out. There is a bit of a dent in front of the ball, so I'm not sure how this is going to roll out, but I don't really feel like chipping, so we're going to putt this thing. Played there, had a chance of going in. About as easy as putt you can get, 10 feet up the hill into the wind. So, I should make this. Oh! Oh! oh. Ah, that's good. Wow, I thought I was going in. Actually broke more than I thought. Yeah, I just went there at the very end. All right, we got hole eight right here. Uh, dude, I don't know how many times I'm saying in this video, but the backdrop out here is so cool. With the orange trees out there, but part four, pretty dead straight. I think that left bunker is in play, the right one should be carryable. Exactly what I want to do. Settle, 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 settle. Not see it. Hey, I think it might've ran into the rough maybe? It'll be all right. Okay, par four, is that bunk carryable? The right one I think is not in play. The left one is in, oh, okay. is, is in the run out. Okay. That's 
the right. Yeah, rough. I not see it. Should be eight. I feel, I feel like I've only hit one fairway, if that even. <laughs> Makes golf kind of hard. <laughs> But we got 63 yards. Uh, I think 53 is probably the front-ish. Probably trying to get cute, cute with it and trying to land at 53. Uh, no, actually, you know what? Take that back. Because if, if I'm landing it short, that thing is rolling right back to my feet. So we'll go ex at least hit at 53. Pretty solid. Go. Uh, can't really tell, but it looks pretty good. Yeah. Um, I've got same yardage. Just hit a little bit more right. So I'm in the rough, but 63, probably playing about 70, like Quan said, let it roll up a little bit. Get in. Uh, I'm hoping it's close. I had it good. I had hole. it good. I had it good. Oh, Quan short. He's not happy. Look at him. <laughs> not happy. <laughs> All right, well, unfortunately my ball is short of the green. I, I didn't realize it's so like uphill here still. It's all good, still got a putt, a little bit right to left. It should be pretty slow. Curl, drop. Okay. A deep run at it. Pretty straight, uphill, I just got a bit aggressive. Get a nice solid stroke on it. Well, let's get some birdies flying around right here. Yeah, get some birdies. Pretty good. He's gonna walk it in. Wow! Last dimple. It's a lunch. Last lunch. Lunch. <laughs> that was a lunch. We lunched it in. Yes. All right. We got it. We got a bird on the board. It's been a little while since we had that. It's gotten a little windy, so conditions are a little harder than we best thought. Best ball but. break 65. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, best ball break 65. But hey, we gotta turn it up here. Come on. All right, hole nine here. Kind of off an elevated tee shot here. A um, couple bunkers. I think the only bunkers in play are those three. They're kind of back there. This first one's not in play. So try to get one in the fairway here. As Quan said, elevated tee shot um, into the wind. I'm going to try how to draw off that right bunker. Hang, Too hang, much. Hang. Uh, this the bunker? Bunker boys. Very fine. You missed it. <laughs> Bunker boys. Welcome to the team. I mean, Ooh. what in the world is that? I'm not gonna lie, I don't even know where. Oh, there it is. <laughs> almost at the other field, right? I'm almost on the tee box. Good angle. That was horrendous. <laughs> Going for a hike? Yeah. All right. Well. We got 158. There's like no wind right now, and I cannot believe there's no wind. There's got to be some into off the right. <sighs> I think I'm going to have to go with a soft eight. If there really is no wind, then it's a full nine, but I don't. I'm gonna having a hard time believing it. Be nice to me. There we go. <whistles> we got something pretty close there. He's back. Come on. We need, we need to drop something. Okay. One five three meters, about 168 yards. Not the best lie. It's kind of sitting down a little bit. So I've got eight iron. Quan just stuffed one in there from three fairways over. So yeah, I need to follow him. Talk to me. Short. Great. Rolling up a little bit. Pretty decent. Short. 35 feet up the hill, the ridge to get over. My ball went up and then came back down. Which is very unfortunate, but such is life. Oh, I thought it was gonna move right. Yeah, it's very straight. All right, got a decent look off of Ty's putt there. Tough to trust, but I'm gonna have to just go, just go with the line on the ball here. It should move a little bit to the right. Tried to sneak out of there. Break a bit, eh? <laughs> yeah, it did. Just right wow. at the end. Let's go. Made a birdie finally. Let's go. Let's go. Huh? Three fairways over. I know. <laughs> <laughs> 
All right, so me and Ty just finished up the front nine there. That was hole nine. I ended up at even par for the front. Ty is at one under, so <laughs> we got definitely a lot of work ahead of us to try to break 65, but we're definitely gonna do our best trying to make a bunch of birdies fly on the back nine. Thank you guys so much for following me on my journey on all this stuff, and I, it's so cool for me to come back to New Zealand and be able to film content for you guys. If you made it this far, make sure you give me a like. It really helps me out if you guys do that. If you're not subscribed already, and you've seen already three videos of mine, what are you doing? Make sure you hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, and I'll see you on the next one. Hey guys, if you're wanting my help to improve your golf, I put everything I know into my two programs here. In this one, I show you everything that you need to see in your swing in order to be a good ball striker, and if you don't see these things, I show you how to fix it. And in this one, I show you the course management knowledge that elite level players use to play good golf. And these are the things that I wish I knew a long time ago. If you want more information, check out the links in the description below. Also, if you'd like to help support me and my journey, it'd be awesome to have you as one of my patrons where you get access to a private group where I do live streams after my tournament rounds, have exclusive content for patrons only, and even do the occasional giveaway with signed putter head covers. Information about that is also in the description below.